Have you ever decided not to pursue a particular goal or dream, whether it's small or large, maybe even a particular, you know, something really big, like a new business or a career change because of the opinions of others, right? If you answered yes, welcome to the club. I'm sure we've all done it at some point at different scales and levels. If you answered no, you're probably lying a bit. And I don't care that you're lying to me. I care that you're lying to yourself. At the end of the day, it's your life. You're living it for yourself, for your family, your friends, your kids, if you have them. And whenever that time comes for your number to be up, hopefully many, many decades from now, will you look back on your life with fulfillment, happiness, and joy? And will that be a proud moment? Or will you be filled with regrets because you did not pursue your passions, your hopes, your dreams, things you believed you were meant to do because of a comment or two made by someone else? Yes, I mean, this is a tough situation to be in, right? On one end, on one side, everyone wants to be liked, respected. You want people, even if you, even those who say, I don't, I don't, they're lying. Everyone wants others to say nice things about you. They want to say he or she is really good at what they do. They're a nice person. They're knowledgeable. They're, you know, they get everything done and, you know, they're reliable. They're trustworthy, right? Positive things. Everybody wants that. On the other hand, in the grand scheme of things, in most instances and cases, and I'm not talking about your immediate family, you know, your parents, your spouse, your kids, because that, they obviously, their opinions carry a lot more weight. But in general, why do we care? It's your life. You're going to live it. And if you make a mistake, it's your mistake. You're going to fix it. They're not going to swoop in to take care of your problems and your things. So if you truly believe in yourself and you have things that you want to do, do them today. Do them now. Start trapezing, as I like to say. You know, when you're learning, you know, the trapeze artists, when you watch them, obviously those who let themselves go and go crazy are obviously at the expert level. But everybody else is the beginning. They, you know, they grab the next bar first before they let go of this one, right? So start doing that passion. Start spending some time on your passions, at, you know, during nights and weekends. And build that trust within yourself. Build that confidence up. Maybe build a client or two up. If it's a business, of course, and then go after it. If it's a sport, if it's something else, if it's a complete career change, industry change, if it's moving across the world, give it a shot. Because I don't think there are many things worse than nearing the end of your life and looking back at it as a wasted life that wasn't lived to the fullest, that wasn't lived on your own terms. So ask yourself, why do we really care about opinions of others and who they are and what can we do about it? I'm not saying be loose and reckless and do less than intelligent things. But if you're really passionate about something you believe in and you think about it every single day, you owe it to yourself to give it a shot. I don't care if you're 30 or 40 or 50 years old. Give it a shot. And see how it goes. Have a wonderful day. I wish you all the best. Share this video with those who you know should give it a shot. Have a great day.